first meeting Tony almost 20 years ago. Loved him immediately. After I moved to the early mornings full time from the evenings, Tony and I got closer. Literally. Something in the way she moves. I actually remember one time dragging Tony on the set and made him sing a song while I played the ukulele at my green screen. I think he actually had a cold that day, but he did it anyway, and he did it like any professional singer. I am still in awe of you, Tony, and your many talents. And I've learned so much from you, including how to navigate this business and also how to recover from my bloopers. You have to be really careful out there. You do. We've had sex con six rather consecutive days of <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. That was a Freudian slip, but we're going to pretend like we didn't hear it. Your expressions, I mean, they're just priceless. Thank you for being my big brother, for being a part of some of the most joyous moments in my life with me, telling you about my loves and my loss. You were there literally holding my hand through some of the most difficult days of my life and for helping me stay focused here while I was at work as everything else in my life outside of here, uh, as you can imagine, during that time, my late husband, Sean, was fighting cancer. Tony, you are truly the very best and I'm going to miss the heck out of seeing you every day. But I take comfort in knowing that I will still be seeing you moving forward. I'm going to come visit you wherever you go because you are not going to get rid of me that easily. I love you so much, and happy retirement, and I'll see you very soon. And I mean very soon. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Tony, a little story about how we moved at different desks in the newsroom. Yeah. And for some reason, Tony, you went along with me. I moved about five different times in the newsroom. And she and dragged me along. I did. Oh, I dragged Everywhere Tony. she went. Everywhere. And God love you, you didn't argue with me. Like, you went along. Why? How, why did you go along with that? I would come in in the morning, Marissa. We're moving over here, Tony. <laughs> We really did. We used to do a little YouTube Google Hangout. It was on the YouTube channel. And um, thank God for Tony because I, Tony, you are the smartest man I've ever really met. And I just wanted to make sure you were always next to me, having to interview all those people who actually watched you anyway. So they, every celebrity that would step off the set would come and join Tony and I in the newsroom. And so thank God you were always there with me uh, during those times. And you know that was when really people all over the world would watch our channel. So not just the people here in LA have sent me messages, Tony, but from literally from Europe, from Germany, from, from England has told me how much they're really going to miss seeing you as they stream you every day here um, on Good Day LA. So thank you so much for all that time spent with me. It's been well, over 20 years I've known you and uh, thank you so much. Can I just give you a big hug? Because <laughs> Tony, when you um, answer the door when I come to your house, because I know what happens sometimes, I think, will you please put on a robe? Because I, really <laughs> um, okay. I know it's clothing optional over there at your, <laughs> your resort and your pool. Uh, you know what? But, I resemble... Resist, <laughs> oh my gosh. You know, you know, we have had so many good times. My first Dodger game was with you. Yes. Um, and so Wait, mm -hmm. was that when he showed up wearing red? No, that was no, that was the time that I went for the first time oh, okay. and he had the proper gear on. Okay. Okay. So <laughs> we went Angelica, okay. yeah, thank God. But we um, enjoyed my first time having a Dodger dog together. Um, not to mention just some some amazing family moments off the set really have, that yeah. we've shared. So thank you so much for that. Thank you for being my big brother. And um, thank you for bequeathing me your big parking spot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I didn't bequeath it to you. You took it while I, I was still it. alive. <laughs> <laughs> I do take Tony everywhere with me. So. Um, he even lives with me right now. I said, Tony, listen, as you get ready for retirement, come and live over my garage. <laughs> I, d I do. It's a casita. It's In a casita. casita. It is, it, no, it's very nice, actually. It's, yeah. a, it's a proper place, but you always have a place there whenever Thank you want to come back to LA, Thank okay? Um, but we'll be there very She's soon. She's already rented it out. <laughs> She's moved on. It's true. You got to get your stuff out you by Monday. Place, but I have to kick the other tenant out. <laughs> anyway, I love you, Tony. Do I still? I still have a job, so I guess I have to do a little bit of weather here. Okay. 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 We'll, 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 we'll be right me, here. Let me go do that. Um,